بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم Hi there, my name is Jolene Garcia and today I'm going to be demonstrating a routine chest x-ray. Um, projections are going to be PA and lateral. Uh, first I'm going to go ahead and make sure that my room is set up correctly, starting with um, detenting my tube to a 72 inch XID. There it is. Uh, next I'm going to make sure that my IR is in position. It's going to be a portrait because I'm going to be doing um, a female exam today. Um, the strip is going to be on top. It's a 14 by 17. Go ahead and place it in. Make sure that the wall bucket is aligned with my tooth. Make sure that the collimation is um, in alignment with a 14 by 17 inch IR. Um, and then next I'm going to go ahead and put my marker um, in the anatomically correct position. Left marker on the left side. Just so I don't forget. Right there. Um, next I'm going to go ahead and get my patient. Grab the rest of the form. Step out into the waiting room. Heather Boma? Yes. Hi, how are you doing today? I'm well, how are you? Very good, thank you. If I could just verify your last name and your, your full first and last name. Heather Boma. Perfect, and your date of birth? 568. Wonderful. Um, and do you know why you're coming in today? Um, I've been having some chest pain. Okay, and how long has that been going on? About a week. About a week? Yeah. Perfect, all right. I'll get you some chest images. Um, first, I'd like to ask if you have any jewelry that you're wearing that could obstruct the view? No. No? And then is there any possibility of you being pregnant? No. All right. Can go ahead and shield you? is a good one and a half to two inches um, above the shoulder. Bring this down a little. Um, so my central ray is going to be entering at mid-sagittal uh, T7. shoulders forward so that she can get the scapula out of her lumpel so we can get a good view. Making sure that, again, the collimation is one and a half inches to two inches above her shoulder to make sure that we don't clip any of uh, her anatomy, um, her apices. Next, I'm going to give her some instructions. Go ahead, Heather, and hold your breath. Take a deep breath in. Go ahead and release it. Take a deep breath in again. Hold it. X-ray. Beep. Take the x-ray. Go ahead and breathe normally. And relax if you'd like. Um, the technique on that, I'm going to be using a 110 kVp with anywhere between 4 to 8 mis. But for hers, I'm probably going to use a... ...about a 6. Then I can go ahead and take out the film. I'm going to have to remove it, take it to the reader, scan it, read it, uh, make sure that it's a good image so we don't have to do a repeat. Next, I'm going to take a clean image. I'm going to go ahead and put it again, portrait with the green strip up, and bring it in. And then for my lateral projection, I'm going to have Ms. Boma face the wall with her left side, with her left shoulder to the bucky. I'm going to remove the shielding so that it shields from this point. Um, I'm going to have to move my marker to the front. And then I'm going to have you raise your arms up like so. Go ahead and put your shoulders together or your elbows together. I'm going to make sure that the scapula is um, straight. Shoulders against the wall. Hips are straight. Um, if you can just move 
forward a little bit just to make sure that there's no rotation. Um, I'm going to go ahead and move this up a little so when she takes a deep breath in and her shoulders move up that we don't clip anything. Um, move this up, be in alignment with that move. The palmation is set, still at one and a half inches to two inches of light above her shoulder. Um, now the central ray is going to be entering from a mid-coronal point, um, still at T7. And then everything looks good. I'm going to go ahead and step out, take the x-ray, give her some breathing instructions. Heather, go ahead and take a deep breath in. Deep breath out, uh, release. Take another deep breath in, hold it. And then I'm going to shoot the x-ray. X-ray, deep. Go ahead and relax. Then I'm going to take the x-ray film again. I'm going to take it to the reader, scan it, read it, make sure that the image came out correctly. Thank you so much. Um, I will go ahead and make sure that your results get to your physician as soon as possible and we'll notify you when you're ready. Thank you. You're very welcome. And for that technique, I'm going to use a 110 KVP with anywhere between an 8 to 12 mass, but for her, I'm probably going to use an 8 mass. All right, that's my routine chest x-ray.